In this video, we're going to actually download and install Python 3 from python.org on a Macintosh. If you, uh, your Macintosh for years has wonderfully come with Python 2. So if I type Python minus minus version, then um, I type that, I see that I've got Python 2.0. What we want to do is, in addition, install Python 3. One of these days, uh, uh, Macintosh might upgrade their distributed, distributed version of Python 3, but there's so many things inside Mac that depend on Python 2, I'm going to expect that it will always be named Python 3, which is what we're going to call it in a second. So here I am at the python.org downloads, and I'm going to download Python uh, 3. You click here, and I've actually got it sitting here in downloads already because I always do that. And so, um, so I'm going to install this. There is the installer. I'm going to say continue, continue, continue. Of course I agree. I read all that really fast, and now I'm going to install it. Okay. So now... That means if I run a terminal, so this of course is start run terminal, so Python 2 is still there, but Python 3 is also now involved there, so we should have Python 3 installed. So we installed Python 3.6, and so there we go, and that's all it takes to install Python 3 on the Macintosh. Uh, so let's write our first little Python program. Um, I'm going to, uh, I, I like Atom. Um, and so I've got this Atom editor, it's Atom.io, right here, Atom.io, download and install the Atom editor. I like it because Atom works the same on both uh, Windows, Mac, and Linux, and it has syntax highlighting, and so I really like things like that. So I'm going to make myself a uh, simple Python uh, program. Hello world, like we always do. Now you'll notice that it's not syntax highlighting yet, but I'm going to do a file, save, oopsie daisy, file, save as, and I'm going to go into my desktop and I want to make a folder called py4e. I'm just going to call this hello.py. Oh crud. Got to rename it. Rename it. I ended up with two dots. Hello.py. There we are. And so now I'm here, and I'm in my home folder. I can go into my desktop, and I can go into that new folder I made, Python for Everybody, and I can see the files. Now, you, there are ways to run this, and I really don't. I really want you to learn the terminal so that you really know what you're doing. And so here we are. We are in the folder that has the Python, and then all we do to run it is we say Python 3 hello.py, and there we go. And of course, this is Python 3 because I'm using parentheses there. So um, instead of double quotes, but Python 2 is still there. And of course, if you just run Python hello.py, it'll be a syntax error or not. Must be they added something. <laughs> yeah, because Python is still version still version 2, but apparently they allowed print in uh, the latest version of Python 2. So so away we go. Okay, so uh, again, uh, thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful uh, to you to get Python 3 installed on your Macintosh.